Yeah, I know you've been tracking this whole thing. Uh, and that rain just continues to fall, so they have to get through today. And then tomorrow, that's when things will finally start to improve. But let's get right to it, looking at the latest look on satellite and radar. With showers that still are falling across Los Angeles, seeing more of the same across San Francisco, even some snow across the higher elevations. That will taper off later tomorrow. Also, looking ahead for us, a little piece of this energy that will swing off to the east, bringing us some rain late Thursday into Friday. But right now, things are quiet with high pressure settling in, keeping rain and cloud cover away from us. And this is the result. A beautiful afternoon, nice and pleasant sunshine, a temperature of 36 in Central Park. It feels like 31 thanks to a northeasterly breeze around 6 miles per hour. So we still have enough of a breeze to bring us down to those real flow numbers in the low to mid 30s. Currently numbers in the 30s closer to the boroughs is 35 in Bensonhurst. Gravesend 36 also in the Bronx. 30 for you still below freezing. 32 in Bridgeport Montauk. You're at 33. Latest winds are out of the east, ranging from around 5 to 10 miles per hour, and will keep a light breeze throughout the rest of this afternoon. But back over to satellite and radar, clear skies thanks to high pressure. Some things will slowly start to change tonight. That's all thanks to easterly flow. That's going to push in additional moisture, and that's why overnight through sunrise tomorrow, we could start out the day with a few more clouds around, but we'll still have a nicer amount of sunshine on Wednesday. So tomorrow, sun mixing in with some clouds. Thursday, that's when it really turns cloudy as these storm systems get a little bit closer in that area low pressure that I talked about uh, that will swing in off to the south on Friday, bringing us rain at times. So a wet and breezy day. Late Friday, that rain pushes out of here and return on Saturday. We dry out, but it will be blustery and much colder. We fall down to a higher 36. Strong winds will make it feel more like the mid to upper 20s on Saturday, but still dry for the second half of the weekend. Temperatures, too, this weekend dipping briefly below average on Saturday. We get back closer to normal on Sunday. And looking ahead for the extended forecast, the latest outlook from the Climate Prediction Center is showing that we will likely have above normal temperatures as we bring in next month. And keep in mind, average high around the first week of March, that's around 44 to 45 degrees, a low near 32. Today, we only reach a high of 39 degrees. The average high today in Central Park near 43, so chilly despite plenty of sunshine. Tonight, we fall into the upper 20s in the city, the lower 20s in some of the suburbs with a few clouds. Tomorrow, 44 degrees, a bit milder, back closer to normal, and we turn partly cloudy. For the rest of the seven-day forecast, things will continue. Clouds will continue to increase rather on Thursday and then Friday, wet and breezy, 49, a bit milder, but we also have to deal with rainfall. Saturday, we dropped to 36, really gusty winds. Sunday, 43, and then look at Monday, that climb above average, 54 degrees. But the mixture of sunshine and clouds will likely see additional days next week in the 50s. It, it, Monday wants to be 60. <laughs> it wants right. to be, okay. I, I have a kinship with the temperature, <laughs> and it wants 60, but 54 is good. Okay, that's yeah, like that's it. not bad. Right. Monday, Monday, otherwise known as Dave Navarro. <laughs> He wants 60. I want, I'm working on getting my own day, so it's not there yet. Thanks he a wants lot, it, friend. Right. Thank you. Hey, more concerns about TikTok and digital safety this afternoon. Still ahead on Eyewitness News, the European Union's new investigation into whether the social media platform is protecting people. Plus, the new tech that makes it even more difficult to tell whether videos you see are real or fake.